Hello and welcome ladies and gentlemen to this week's edition of Blazers Inside Access. I'm Kirk McDonald. We're here at Smith Wills Stadium, the home of Bellhaven Baseball. And speaking of baseball, this week's C Spire Athlete of the Week is Jason Hicks of the baseball team. In five games last week, Hicks had 10 hits, three home runs, and nine runs batted in, leading the Blazers to four out of five victories against Auburn Montgomery, Freed Hardman, and Bethel. Since our last edition of Bellhaven Blazers Inside Access, the Blazer baseball team has played six games, including five last week. They went on the road to Bethel and beat the uh, Wildcats 10-0 in seven innings. They lost at Freed Hardeman 10-1, but then came back for a three-game Southern States Athletic Conference Series sweep against Auburn Montgomery last weekend. The Blazers won Friday night 6-4. They won again on Saturday 3-2 and won 14-13 in the final game of the series on Saturday thanks to Bud Britt's two-run walk-off home run in the bottom of the 10th inning. Bellhaven started this week with a 6-4 victory at Millsaps. The Blazers are now 3-0 in Maloney Series play and 21-12 overall. The Bellhaven men's golf team competed at the William Carey Collegiate Classic in Hattiesburg on Monday and Tuesday of this week. The Blazers finished sixth at the tournament, but Ian McAdams finished fourth overall in the individual standings, one of his best performances as a Blazer in golf tournaments. The Bellhaven tennis teams were off this past week, but they've got a full slate of matches scheduled for this weekend. The women take on LSU Shreveport on Friday. The men and women battle Spring Hill on Friday as well. Then on Saturday, both the men's and women's tennis teams take on Rust and the University of Mobile. The Bellhaven softball team has been busy with games this past week and then this week as well. To end last week, the Blazers went to Alcorn State and defeated uh, the Braves 8-1 and 3-0 in a non-conference doubleheader. Then at William Carey's tournament this past Saturday, the Blazers took out LSU Alexandria 5-3 and defeated Embry-Riddle 2-0 in eight innings. Earlier this week, the Blazers on Tuesday split a Southern States Athletic Conference doubleheader with Spring Hill. They lost game one 7-4 but came back with a 6-1 victory in game two of that doubleheader. We've got a full slate of games this weekend as it's green and gold weekend on the campus of Bellhaven University. The Bellhaven men's baseball team will battle Southern Westland in a three-game Southern States Athletic Conference Series beginning on Friday at 4. Then they'll play game two of a doubleheader later on Friday. A single game is scheduled now on Saturday at 1 p.m. The Bellhaven softball team will host Emmanuel at 1 o'clock on Friday, followed by a doubleheader against Southern Westland on Saturday at 1 p.m. And the men's and women's tennis teams, we mentioned them, they're in action uh, at home this weekend against LSU Shreveport, Spring Hill, Mobile, and Rust. The Bellhaven men's and women's tennis teams both ranked in the latest NAI Top 25 poll. The women are 24th, the men are 14th. The softball team is ranked 18th in the first regular season poll in the Top 25. That wraps up another edition of Blazers Inside Access. I'm Kirk McDonald. Thanks for joining us this week. Don't forget about all the action taking place on the campus of Bellhaven University this weekend with Green and Gold Weekend. We'll also be honoring the 2012 Men's Soccer National Championship with a presentation of their rings prior to Game 2 of the doubleheader on Friday in Bellhaven's baseball contest with Southern Wesleyan at Smith Wills Stadium. For all the latest news and information, check it out at our athletics website, blazers.bellhaven.edu. And don't forget to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter at Bellhaven Blazers. Once again, folks, thanks for joining us this week, and we'll see you next week on another edition of Blazers Inside Access.